Hey guys, today I'm gonna talk about the burpee pull-up that you guys have in your workout. So we will take the approach that we had during the open. So as far as finding the height for the barbell, or uh, for the pull-up bar that you're gonna use, thumbs are gonna go together, you're gonna reach overhead. As long as your hands don't touch that bar, you are good. Okay, I am gonna challenge you guys to try to reach all the way up. So if you are reaching and your fingertips are brushing, go to a little bit higher of a bar. Now, if you need to, we do have the mats that you guys can use to elevate your uh, height just a little bit so that you're not too far underneath a, a mat. Um, other thing I wanna talk about is the pull-up portion of the burpee pull-up. So you may use a pull-up grip, a switch grip, or a chin-up grip. Um, I will I'll let you guys choose what you want to do. Benefits to a lot of them. Sometimes a chin-up grip is gonna be a little bit stronger. If you do decide to go with a switch grip, I will um, say that you should focus on switching that back and forth between your reps um, so that you're working both sides. Another thing to think about for the burpee pull-up, um, when you're performing this movement, um, you want to make sure that when you're jumping up, so you want to be directly under this bar, and then when you're kicking your feet back and jumping up, you're planting your feet directly under the bar so that when you go to jump, you are right underneath to finish that movement versus if I do my burpee pull up back here and I bring my feet up, now I have to step up and you're just creating a little bit more work. So move with intention, move with a purpose on that. Try not to be uh, like traveling all around while doing this one. Scaling this uh, movement today, if you need to, um, use that same approach of burpee pull up. However, elevate your height so you don't have to pull as high. So, so do your burpee, step up, come to your pad, and then finish your rep there. Um, give as, as much height as you need when scaling that so you can complete the rep and focus on that pulling portion at the top. Um, and then other than that, just have a good workout. The burpee pull-ups are short. It's only three per round. So um, by that third round, you should have those mechanics kind of dialed in and have a good rhythm of where your feet are going and what grip you're using and all that stuff. Cool.